about that. So this is just showing kind of like if this part of the if this part of the heart right here wasn't getting oxygen, it's, just, it's dying. So cardiac area of infarction. Now, if the tissue right here dies where it's showing, do you think that's going to affect the pathway of the conduction system? Anybody? Yes, yes, I think so. Absolutely, yes. So your patients that are having a heart attack, so myocardial infarction, um, it's, a, it's a, heart, um, a heart attack. This does two things to your patients. One is that if, it's, if it lasts long enough, they will actually get um, cardiac con uh, heart failure. They'll get congestive heart failure because that tissue right here is dead. So that means this muscle, this part of the heart is no longer pumping at all or barely because that tissue is dead. It's no longer good. And once heart tissue starts to die, it does not come back. It's going to stay dead. So one is this patient will eventually have congestive heart failure. Most likely, they will have that. Second is the conduction tissue, the pathways of electricity um, in this region are not going to work as adequate as they once were. And now that can also lead to dysrhythmias down the road. So this is a, a one example of how one medical condition can lead to multiple other conditions. Uh, so congestive heart failure, and we just talked about that. So that's, it's kind of good how they tie it together. So myocardial infarction can definitely lead to congestive heart failure, and that's because of the tissue damage. So now your pumper has been damaged, and it can't be repaired. Uh, so it's only going to do as best as best as it can, but it's going to have a backup of blood because it's not functioning as good as it should be because of the damage. So inadequate pumping of the heart, we talked about that. Uh, the second bulletin also discussed. See, may be brought on by diseased heart valves, hypertension, obstruction. Uh, yeah, so that's all the stuff that can happen. Any questions about the slide, anybody? Any questions at all? Like, like it says in the bottom, often a complication of AMI, and that is what we just talked about. It's a acute myocardial infarction. Okay, so progression, again, myocardial infarction of the left ventricle dies because of damage. Left ventricle blood backs up into pulmonary circulation. So this is kind of, it's just explaining what I, it's explaining what I just explained, but just in, in different words, pretty much. It's just saying how uh, a heart attack, and again, a heart attack equals myocardial infarction. It's the exact same thing. It's just saying how a heart attack can lead to, car, to heart failure. That's all the same. All right, guys, let's go ahead and take another little 10-minute little break. Right